Alright, all you Streetlight Crusaders, welcome back to the Tuesday Night Special! And Maestro told me, while we were just talking back and forth during the break, that one of the people who was involved in King of the Hill was also Mary Tyler Moore, who played the person who was in charge of the church at one point. Wow, they really did have a lot of stars during that show, didn't they? And speaking of stars, ladies and gentlemen, and no, we don't have any celebrities around here. No, it's just a certain weatherman who's dressed up in a suit with glow-in-the-dark stickers on it. None other than Dan the Weatherman Stu here to give the final weather update or weather forecast for this week heading into the new year. So without further ado, with a screw up of that introduction, Dan the Weatherman Stu... And he turned off the lights so I could see the ridiculous stars all over his coat. The microphone is all yours. Uh, <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls from around the world, it's your boy from Chicago, Illinois. Dad, the one of us do here to bring in a fight that would forecast for this week. <laughs> and the maestro's cousin was able to design this coat for me. <laughs> So I feel special, a part of the Tuesday night special. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so he designed that coat for you. So besides him being a guitar player and now a seamstress of sorts, what else can he do, Maestro? Oh, apparently he can make oversized disco balls for Dan the Weatherman Stu. So you know what, Dan the Weatherman Stu, I give up. What in the world, or how big, or, you know what, even better question, what do you plan to do with that giant oversized disco ball? Well, DJ Smokey, with those 45 questions coming at 30 rounds per second, I'm going to use that giant disco ball to bring out the year on a high note. <laughs> Since New York City may not bring the ball, I got a ball of my own. <laughs> Behold outside your window. You know, I know I'm going to get a headache if I look to the left, but I'm going to do it anyway, folks. Give me a second. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Yep. Um, well, ladies and gentlemen, here's the thing. You know that giant oversized tree outside of Music Village headquarters? Why in the world am I describing things to you fans out there that you've never seen before? Let's just say that there's a giant oversized disco ball on the top of a tree leaning back and forth, and I got a feeling it's going to fall at a moment's notice, and oh, yikes. Well, Dan the Waterman Stew, that plan went south. That disco ball just fell and shattered on the side of the street. Wait a minute, did it hit a Cadillac outside? Well, my God, it hit my car. Oh, no. <laughs> Damn, the one man still may need to fix that after this. Oh, yeah, I forgot you still have to do the weather. You're wasting time, man. We're running out of time here for the final Tuesday of the year. Get on the weather, man. Jeez. All right. <laughs> so for tonight, that's right, Tuesday night. It's going to be a low of 20 degrees. Cloudy skies all around. Scratch that clear as a bell with the moon shining bright. Yeah. With not a wind in the sky. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And on Wednesday, another cold day for you. Cause it's gonna be a high of 40 degrees, low of 32. Mostly cloudy skies with winds going south, southwest at nine miles per hour. And on Thursday, <laughs> the end of the year. Cause it's gonna be a high of 44, low of 26. Morning showers at 45%, with winds going west, northwest, at 7 miles per hour. And on Friday, <laughs> first weekend of the new year, boy, boy, cause it's gonna be a high of 40 degrees, low of 32. Nightly rain showers at 75%, with winds going east, northeast at five miles per hour. And on Saturday, 
more rain for you. Cause it's gonna be a high of 56, low of 35. Morning showers at 40%, with winds going west at 11 miles per hour. And on Sunday, not a sunny day at all. Cause it's gonna be a high of 42, low of 30 degrees. Rainy skies all around at 65%, with winds going north, northeast, at 9 miles per hour. And now you know, cause I've gotta go, because I am damned what a man do what I am through. So what a broadcast for this week. <laughs> and now back to the man who's holding a broom and dustpan in his hand. DJ Smokey for the Tuesday Night Special. <laughs> yeah! Now, I automatically know why in the world you think I'm holding this dustpan in my hand, so I'm gonna just tell you to get to it. Because you have about, mm, I guess, three, four hours until sunrise, so yeah, go to get the sweeping. Get the sweeping. Because if that's out there on the street by morning and it breaks someone's tires, you're paying for it. Not me, you're paying for it. All right, DJ Smokey. <laughs> Looks like I gotta go outside and sweep and go back to the drawing board with a bigger disco ball for New Year's Eve. <laughs> so till then, Happy New Year and damn the what a man's do out. Hey, that doesn't mean you get a chance to build another disco ball in my yard. Gang, where you going? And he's gone. And he's gone. Well, you know, at least if he builds that disco ball out of whatever paper mache ability or skill that your cousin had, it doesn't cost us any money. What do you mean it costs us $500? You know what? Before I get angry on this microphone, I think it's time for us to head back to the music. And when we return, we'll be back with yet another edition of the Indie Report right after this. So don't go anywhere just yet, folks, and stay tuned. 